Good morning. Welcome to Jessila. Jesus Christ is Lord. Amen. This is a channel for Christians and non-Christians alike. This is a channel for those who are seeking to find a personal relationship with the Lord Jesus Christ and the Almighty God and the Holy Spirit. If this is your first time on this channel, we welcome you. And if you are an existing subscriber, we thank you and we pray that your faith continue to grow. And in this channel, we advise you that before you read your Bible, you always pray so that the Holy Spirit will come and minister to you. Dear Lord and Father of mankind, forgive our foolish ways. Be clothed us in our rightful mind, impure lies that service fine. In deep reverence, praise. In deep reverence, praise. Prayer. Father, we thank you for the gift of waking up. You are the Almighty God. Jehovah is your name. There is none like you. You are the maker of heaven and earth. Great is thy faithfulness, Almighty God. We thank you for Jesus, who is the proposition for our sins. We thank you for the finished work, Jesus. You are our Lord and personal Savior. And this morning we bring to you, Lord, all those who are still outside your grace, those who are still living in darkness, those who are still following ritualistic religion, Father, we pray that they will come to know you and the power of your resurrection because you are a good God. You are a son of the Most High God and we are joined here to your throne, to the throne of our Father, Almighty God. Father, we thank you for Jesus Christ. We thank you, Almighty God, for the making of us beautifully and wonderfully made. Father, you have given each and every one a free will. And a lot of this free will, Father, is making people's hearts stony. They are not believing. But we pray this morning, Father, as we pray daily to you, that you alone, who incarnated yourself in your Son, Jesus Christ, to be the atonement for our sin, you alone can send them to Christ. Because the Word of God says, only those that you send to Christ, will Christ save. Father, we pray that you that you do not want these souls to perish. We pray that you bring them to Christ. We pray that they will use their free will wisely, Father, so that they will not perish, so that on the last day, Lord, it will not be too late for them. Father, we ask that you continue to hold us with your righteous hand. Jesus, we thank you for your faithfulness. Great is your faithfulness, Lord, unto us. Thank you, Lord Jesus. We praise your holy name. We bless you, almighty God. We lift your name high. Father, you are God. God of everything. There is nothing impossible for you, Lord. Father, seek and let these people come to Christ. Father, bring them to Christ. We pray, Lord, that they will not perish. Father, we continue to ask you to guide us daily so that we will not say we are standing because you alone, it is your grace, not our might, not our power. Father, we give you praise, we give you honor, and we glorify your name. And we say, blessed be your name. We say, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Almighty God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for everything. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray this morning. Amen. We are going to continue our reading from the book of John, chapter 3, from verse 13. No one has ascended into heaven except the one who descended from heaven, the Son of Man. Just as Moses lifted up the snake in the wilderness, so the Son of Man must be lifted up so that everyone who believes in him will have eternal life. For God so loved the world in this way, he gave his one and only Son, so that everyone who believes in him 
will not perish but have eternal life. For God did not send his Son into the world that he might condemn the world, but that the world might be saved through him. Anyone who believes in him is not condemned, but anyone who does not believe is already condemned because he had not believed in the name of the one and only Son of God. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Breathe through the hearts of our desire, thy coolness and thy balm. Let sense be dumb, let flesh retire, 